now I have this uh, lovely, goofy image of myself. I can put it on top of another image and make all sorts of fun things. So if I go to File, Open Image, I believe I have, yep, Mount Rushmore. Da -da -da, saved here. Now, I can move this picture onto this picture a number of different ways. One of the ways that we do it would be to select all, copy, and then paste. Another way would be to go into layers and open image as layer. Now go in, find my picture I just saved, and then that would also do the same thing. So as always with computers, there's a zillion ways to do things. You just find the one that works for you. So um, now I can click on my head and move it around. Make sure that you're on the selector tool. Um, so I'm on that. I cannot do much about the size right now until I click on free transform. Now this will give me um, little anchor points around my picture so I can make it smaller, I can make it larger, I can do whatever I need to do here. You can even um, go in and turn your picture if you need. And I'm going to move this around and see what I can do to turn myself into one of the faces of Mount Rushmore. So you can see it's totally goofy. Sure, I'll apply the changes. Totally goofy looking. Um, I can go in and possibly turn it black and white. I could try to make the edges more fuzzed out, um, add some other pictures in there, and you can make all sorts of funny things. Um, you can, of course, use this tool more seriously, but um, I why not have fun with it? Now, the only last thing I would want to tell you is that if I have to stop working on this photo for the day and come back to it at another time, it's really important that I go in and save it as a PXD layered Pixlr image. So that way I can go back and open it back up in Pixlr later and go back and work on it. If I don't save it as a PXD, then it'll end up saving as either a PNG or a JPEG. And then those are flat image files. And if I want to retain those layers so I can go back in and edit, it's super important that I save it as that, that Pixlr project file, that PXD file. So I'm going to call it Mount Rushmore work in progress. So that'll be easier for me to find. So I'm going to say OK save it on the desktop. Now I have it saved, um, so if I have to quit for the day and come back another class period to add my other faces, I can do that.